Hello, welcome to Bad Power, now you guy me, try speed end game content. One second. Okay, starting the music. Okay, things clearly a little bit different right now. So, um, as you can see, I'm wearing a Naruto headband, hidden leaf, blah -de blah blah is what it looks like, in case you're curious. I got it on Amazon. So, this video is not a Puzzle Dragons related video, but I was actually just wondering, um, I'm going to be going to Fanime Con, which is or Fanime for short, actually never heard Fanime for short, Fanime for short, which is located in San Jose Convention Center, San Jose, this weekend, May 25th, uh, California, by the way, May 25th, May 28th. I will be going, attending on Saturday, probably from like 11.30 to like whenever it closes that day, just for Saturday, I'll be going. And I was just wondering, oops, sorry, where was I? Let me go back to the website so you can see other things. Um, the website is not apparently not adjusted for <laughs> iPhone or for phone. Um, but I was just wondering if any of you guys are going, if you happen to live in the San Jose, San Francisco Bay Area, or if you are traveling here for this event. I know there's a similar event, which I believe is next week or so in LA, which is Anime Expo, which I'm so sad that I cannot go to that one because Gung Ho is actually gonna be there selling official Puzzle Dragons merch, and I wish I could get a Tomato keychain and a um, Best Doggo Anubis shirt, but maybe if I'm lucky they'll have it here, but I kind of doubt they will because Gung Ho didn't announce anything about it. Anyways, this is basically an anime convention, so everything anime gaming related, they'll have a bunch, like a ton of merch probably, I've never been to Fanime, by the way. I've been to Crunchyroll Expo, which is like a smaller Fanime, is what someone told me, and it's held by Crunchyroll. This is Fanime, which is, I think it's bigger, and it's held by fans. Crunchyroll is, was put on by the company, and I believe last year was the first year they had it. Anyways, I've been, that was only, that's the only anime convention I've been to before. This is what I wore to there, this casual Naruto, um, which I'm going to be wearing something similar this year, which, which I don't have with me, I, or I Amazon some stuff today, so you cannot see. I wish I could show you what I was going to wear, but it's just more casual stuff, casual cosplay. Um, anyways, I was wondering if any of you are going to attend this, anyone who lives here on Saturday, and if by any chance uh, you wanted to meet up, if a number of you wanted to meet up, meet in person, hang out a bit, explore some solves together or something on the off chance that um, I don't actually know where most of you guys live um, but on the off chance that any of you do live here do you want to meet up? <laughs> That's basically what I want to make this video about. If a number of you are interested then uh, we'll see what we'll do from there so just leave a comment below if you're going to be attending on Saturday or the other days for, the, for meeting up it would matter on Saturday. Um, we can all be weebs together. Weebs for life, I guess. I didn't even know what weeb was until last year, and someone told me. I thought it was just otaku or something. I don't know. I'm not a... Am I a otaku? I don't know. By the way, this is an aside. Um, on stream the other time, I asked for some... Like, last Saturday, I asked for some manga and anime recommendations, and I... You guys gave me a few of them. I don't remember who gave me which ones, but they've all been very good so far. I have read through the... Whoever recommended um, Promised Neverland or... Yakusoku, my Japanese accent is terrible. I don't really, I don't know how to speak Japanese, but Yakusoku Neverland or something is what it's called. Promise Neverland, excellent, excellent, excellent. Best manga I've read in a long time. I caught up all the way, really good. I also watched um, Erased, um, which Erased was really good, but it was kind of like scary thriller, kind of. Like, I was like, oh my god, like, it's kind of intense. Um, the ending I thought was like a little, it felt a little bit flat, but the rest, the stuff in the middle was like really great. Um, and also I'm going to start watching, um, Your Lie in April tonight because I saw some good reviews for it on the internet. But if, for whoever suggested those to me, they were very good. Good job everyone. So I know we have some fellow weebs here. I mean, we are all playing Puzzle Dragons, which is a, sorry, which is a m m game that is really popular in Japan, so not super surprised. Anyways, leave a comment down below if you're going to be attending Fanime and if you would like, and let me know also in the comment if you would like to meet up or hang out or something. I don't know. If if a number of you are interested, we'll, I'll make another video later with more details. I don't know how this will work out. I have no idea if any of you even live here or if anyone's going to be attending, but this is just a PSA, not PSA, like a 
invitation? I don't know, just to see what'll happen. So, um, I think that's it for this video. Um, there's no new pad content. I mean, they're gonna do like a Evo stacking update next week, which is cool. Uh, no new pad videos for a little bit until they put out some more dungeons or something to clear, I think. Um, but I'll put, up a, put out a follow-up video to this one if people are interested. If no one's going or anything, then there will be no follow-up video. <laughs> But that would hopefully be up by Thursday or Friday, I think. Hopefully tomorrow. Yes, let me know in 24 hours. It should be up. I should make the video tomorrow so you have enough time to coordinate things and stuff like that. Anyways, that is all, and I will see you in the next video. Goodbye.